again. <sighs> Hello everyone and welcome back to The Evil Within. My name is Hawkward and I was gonna say we had a rage quit last time. We didn't really have a rage quit, we had more of a fed up quit. That was the wrong fucking button last time. And uh, we're getting right back into it. Oh, I hear a save point. Was there a save point here this whole fucking time? Or has it put me way back? Oh, shit me! Where the fuck did you come from? Oh, great. Excuse me. Uh, how do I open the thing? That's how I open the thing. Yes, I want that. Are you not dead yet? Fuck's sake. Go away. Well, that wasted those. But I got a flamey and a grenade. I'm pressing it the wrong X. I'm pressing Xbox X again. Silly me. So, I'm determined to beat this fucking chainsaw dude this time. Uh, I think it was kind of a mixture of I couldn't really be bothered by that time because I was a little bit tired and I was a little bit kind of. I just wanted to go around. <laughs> so once I died again, I was like, I can't be asked to try again. I just want to go to sleep. So. It seemed like a good time to leave it anyway. Is there no uh, notebook in this one? Or I, I haven't already been in here, have I? I can't believe I've missed this the whole time. I'm assuming I have anyway. Have I? You don't Ooh. feel well at all. I don't feel well. This is stressful, man. Okay. Is that new? No, that was there already, wasn't it? Any more newspapers? No. Anything in here? Probably not. So we opened with a nice heart attack to start us off. That was lovely. Whoa, was there someone in there? Eh. No, I think that was just the sink. <laughs> no, nothing going on. Okay. So anyway, yes, um, I didn't really do much last time, which I apologise for. Uh, I know, I said I'm sorry, okay? Jesus. Just one bitch, bitch, bitch. So, assuming I can actually beat this guy this time, which, you know, of course I can. Does that just take me back? That must just take me back. I'm going to try and actually make some fucking progress and uh, maybe whiz through a little bit faster than I normally would because I do like to explore things. What is that? What is that? Is that an explosive bolt? Maybe? I can only take two? Oh, come on, you absolute tease. Is that what that was? Yeah! Nice. Oh, I feel less bad about wasting those other two now. Well, not wasting them, but using them. Because I thought I had the other ones equipped, but maybe I only had one of the other ones. I can't go that way. Okay. So, the plan is, not that it's going to happen, but the plan is to try and make up twice as much progress this episode as I normally would to kind of make up for reaching a bit of a standstill last time. Like I say, it's not really going to happen, but the intention is there, and I think that's important. <laughs> And I also have beer to help it along this time. Uh, this was on sale when I went shopping the other day. I've never had it before, Medusa. Um, but it's supposed to taste like um, rich toffee apple with roasted chocolate aromas. Uh, it's a ruby red ale, which again I've not had. I usually drink pale ales or just lagers. Um, so hopefully it's nice after, <laughs> after spending a whole pound. I'm not sure I would immediately say, oh yes, that's toffee and roasted chocolate aromas, but there is something sweet like in the back of it, it's really weird. Because you have that kind of bitter 
ale taste at the front and then something right at the back is kind of like yeah I guess kind of toffee-ish sugary but the beer will help it along I'm sure uh, what am I doing? agony bolts oh I can upgrade agony bolts uh, increase damage maybe maybe abilities life gauge Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Uh, increase maximum life. That would probably help since we learned the hard way last time that I kinda needed that. Uh, yeah. I think I'm doing okay with sprint, because I, I... If you just sprint like a second at a time, it's kind of enough to keep you ahead, mostly. So I'm, uh, that's, a, that's a possible one, but I'll, I'll, th I'll think about it, see what else we've got. Melee damage is fucking useless, so there's no point in upgrading that. Uh, we can't get that anyway. Oh, I see, okay, right, so what have we got for agony crossfire? Charge time, range, charge time. Oh, I see, just for reloading. Range, reload time. No, wait. So if that's reload time, what the fuck is charge time? Decrease the time it takes to draw the crossbow while aiming for faster firing. I hadn't really noticed an issue with that. Because, maybe because I always take a second to aim anyway. Possibly. I don't know. Oh, well, there's no point in upgrading it if I haven't found issue with it. Range. I think we're okay for, because usually they're like, <laughs> So I don't really need to worry about that yet. Reload time, not too bad. Uh, damage multiplier. Although if I upgrade stock, if I can, put plus one, then I can get one of the other agony bolts, the explosive ones from that room, and take it with me, which could be helpful. They're quite expensive, these things. Hmm... I don't really eat matches, it's fine. I don't know, I, I want to get it, but at the same time I'm really paranoid that I'll spend this money, uh, this money, this uh, brain juice, and then find something that I really need. But if I get this and maybe stamina, although I was out of handgun ammo as well, so maybe I should get more of that. I don't know, I just don't know. Hmm. Damage multiplier. Oh, damage multiplier. That would be better. Yes, I didn't even look at these, did I? My rage, reload time, clip capacity, accuracy. I did. Oh, yeah, I got accuracy last time, didn't I? Yes, yes, I did. No, because then I. <laughs> okay, I'm going to get accuracy again. Although that just that doesn't increase no just increases the decreases the sway, sorry. I definitely can't get that. Oh I don't know what to do. I don't know. Fuck it, let's just get that. Why not? That wasn't even one the one of the ones I was considering, but let's get it anyway. Uh Sorry, if, you, if I'm doing weird things with my mouth, it's because my wisdom tooth, teeth have kind of been half grown through for years, and I think they're finally kind of coming through a bit more. So it's really sore here on both sides where I've kind of, the my cheeks are a bit kind of raw from the rubbing. So if you see me pulling any weird faces, that's why, I apologise. Mmm... <laughs> Fuck okay, it, let's just get accuracy again. As I seem to recall, I missed quite a lot last episode, and that could be the reason I keep fucking dying. Okay. Uh, Seve. Yes. Okay, let's go. I'm not entirely sure where we are now, because I feel like possibly because I switched it off I've been put a lot further back, 
which is why there's a save room. Because I was quite thorough with my exploration, I thought. So surely I would have noticed a save room. But, you know, maybe I didn't. No. Uh -huh. Did I hear someone? That's a good point. What am I going to use for ammo? Because I don't really want to use my explosive bolts. I haven't got any other bolts and I haven't got any ammo. Great. Okay, we'll just have to try and be sneaky. Well, he's still there. Alright, chill the fuck out. Oh, you know. And my phone's going off as well. Shush! Go away. Um, I know it looks like I'm basically just covering old ground, but I'm kind of trying to see how much of it it's saved from last time, because obviously I didn't save it before I switched off, because you can't. Uh, so I'm just trying to see how much of it saved as a checkpoint and how much of it I'm going to have to redo. And also, don't really want to run up to Chainsaw Guy with no ammo. Because that would be fucking stupid! There doesn't seem to be anybody... Thank you. There doesn't seem to be anybody down there. So, possibly most things have saved and I've just somehow missed these creepy dudes in here which again seems really weird but I suppose not entirely impossible no yeah I've definitely been in here before so how did I miss the save room I'm so confused oh well no point going back anyway Go ahead, see window. Because I don't really want to walk straight into the barn. Oh, nice. Spiky wall of death. Just in case there weren't enough things to kill you around here. Alright, that guy up there is gone. So I must have killed him. I don't see anyone else just yet. I'm trying to be extra careful since I don't have anything to defend myself with. I really don't want to use my explosive bolts just yet. Ooh, brain juice. Now, is that extra? Because I already scooped him up last time. So is that more brain juice that it's just given me again? Because he fell down and gave me a fucking heart attack again? That would be nice. I doubt it, but that would be nice. Oh yeah, there was a statue up here, isn't there? Yes, I'm not entirely sure how to get that. Well, probably just shoot it, but I don't really want to waste my ammo. Hello. Oh, uh, yeah, flash bolts, I remember you. Okay, that could come in handy. And I'll equip it now, just in case. Can I hear someone? I mean, I can, but the question is... Oh! Someone there. I think there's someone over there as well. Yes, there is. Okay. So this seems to be kind of like a weird half respawn since I switched it on last time. I hope he doesn't see me climbing down here. Hello! Don't mind me. I'm just checking the phone lines. It's all good. You're uh, connected to BT or your phone provider of choice, I don't know. I don't really work for them, but it's fine. Now, if I smash this... There's nothing in it, so it's a waste of time. Will you shush? It's really hard to concentrate with you gasping away in my fucking ear. Right. He was over there, wasn't he? And that's the barn, because there's a pig. So... Go this way first. As long as he doesn't see me, I don't think he will. Oh, 
Oh, we're here. Okay. Still creeps me out when the door closes behind me. Is there someone down here? Inch. Inch forward. Is that the guy from upstairs? Jesus. Shush. Shut the fuck up. Actually, don't, because it'll really creep me out if he suddenly goes silent. Yeah. There's nothing but us. Like, at least if he's making creepy-ass noises, you know where he is. Whoa. Don't you be turning around there. I'm not going to come through the wall at you. There's, you know, constant vigilance and all that, but that's definitely not the way I'm coming from. Shush! Ooh. Hello. What you got in the box? Ooh. I almost whistled there. That's the first time in my life. Shotgun. Yes. Give it to me, because I definitely have shotgun shells. Oh, that's so much better. Okay. Some juice. Some on a health kick. Ooh, yes, give. How did I miss all this last time? I'm sure I searched here as well. that way. What you got in the closet, little girl? Shotgun shells, which I can't take. Damn it. Oh, I see. That's the balcony she's looking out on, of course. Of course. I remember you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Wait, is that another statue? Or is that the same one? No, that's another one, isn't it? It's on top of a wall. I'll probably forget or not get it, but, you know, good to know, just in case. Experiment number four. Subject numbers four through thirteen. Brainwave activity diminished, but synchronization achieved. Subjects should begin experiencing a shared consciousness. Previous trials indicated rapid deterioration of consciousness. Their minds became an exquisite mass, an amalgam of mental carrion. I'll have to connect myself if I want to experience their terror before it diminishes. Okay, uh, yeah. Is that what this is then? Because this is pretty fucked up. Hmm. So maybe the evil within is actually... Because that would make sense, because if, you know, obviously where that nurse woman is, is in his head. But that's not really the evil part, the evil part is out here. So it would make sense if this was in someone's head as well. Or maybe it's just referring to whatever device or virus or whatever created this world, as in like the evil within someone concocted this horrible thing, maybe. But it, yeah, it would make sense, especially with the whole shared subconscious thing if this was actually in someone's mind as well so maybe we like volunteered yeah shush I'm talking <laughs> we volunteered to like go in and stop someone not really sure on the oh uh, Ruvik oh fuck don't be coming over here
I want you to just turn around, please. Turn around. Thank you. Turn around. Hmm. I'm gonna have to get a bottle for this one. Possibly. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure Chainsaw Dude like literally spawns a couple of people with him. But, in case he doesn't, it would be prudent of me to try and take out as many people as possible before I go on a suicide mission and try and kill him. That would make the sense. So yes, if this is kind of a shared subconscious thing, especially if they all give in to the terror or whatever it was that he said, then it would make sense that it would be something horrible like this. Hey, how's it going? Shit, he saw me, didn't he? My face has broken out just a little bit too much. Because I was where I was thinking about when I tried to destroy that bomb by throwing a bottle at it and it literally just shit. It hit the wall. No, he's still coming. <laughs> Come on then. Waste all my shotgun shells. Oh, fuck my good. Ooh. That was a horrific noise. Yeah. I think that might be the guy that I saw when I was up on the tower. Okay. Well, that's two taken care of. And I have already been over here, I thought so. Ooh! Nice! At least I got to refill my shotgun shells. So, not a waste. Also good because it's really, judging by how I did la for the last couple of times, it's quite difficult to get away from the guy, so close range weaponry is good. Don't like you. You're not gonna... That definitely wasn't me being stupid. The guy's not breaking free. Come on. Hello, I'm right here. <laughs> I don't want to get any closer. <laughs> Maybe if I just go over to the chainsaw? No? There we go! Wrong button. Shit, don't run straight into the guy with a fucking chainsaw, you idiot. Uh. <gasps> Did I get him? Did I get him? Can I set him on fire? Set him on fire? Set him on fire? No? Shit. Uh. Oh, I thought he was down. Reload first, that would help. <laughs> oh 
almost pulled my TV off because I'm leaning back so I don't get chainsawed. <gasps> yes! First time! This time! <laughs> oh! What the f- Ooh, these bugs! Oh shit! No! I have no ammo, fuck off! Thank you. So did he like possess that guy? Oh! That was stressful. Yeah. The teeth of this old, well-worn chainsaw are caked with all sorts of things. Lovely. Ooh, some juice. Ooh, 5,000 juice. 5,000 juice is good. But now I'm out of ammo again, but uh, never mind. I was actually le leaning back so far that my headphones were about to... <laughs> uh, this? Celebratory swig of beer, I think. Cheers, Sebastian. Are we just leaving that now? Oh, it's been swallowed up by the earth. Okay. Wait! Over here! What do you Wait, want, uh, Jimenez? Officer. I mean, well you done for still being dead. alive. Castellanos. Leslie should be just ahead. It is imperative that we find him. No, oh, that's kind of what I was doing, I think. But okay. Is that the end of the chapter? <laughs> fucking knew it would be. Oh, yeah, I don't like you masked people. You're fucking assholes. Will you shush? Jesus, nobody ever texts me ever. Uh, yes, save. Definitely save. Hmm. Okay, next chapter. Let's go! I can't believe how easy. well, I say easily, but like, I did it first time that time. I think it was literally just because I was actually concentrating on what I was doing instead of just expecting it to work straight away and trying to get through it quickly so I could go to bed. It was definitely a, a lack of concentration last time, so... That was still very stressful. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the hospice. Yes. Leslie was being treated here years ago. He'd come here thinking it was familiar and safe. You know where we are? Just ahead is the hospice my brother runs. He'll take us in. That didn't answer okay. my question. I honestly don't know. For all I know, I'm losing my mind and you're just a delusion. But I'd like to think I still have a shred of dignity and an obligation to protect I'm my I was trying patient. to sprint to catch up with him. As an officer of the law, again. you should too. I hope his brother's not a jerk too. <laughs> Rude. I mean, I think he's allowed to be a bit of a dick considering the circumstances we're in right now. Ooh, what was that? Was that something interesting? That was an axe was something interesting. I will have that. Thank you very much. Oh! Journal of Sebastian Castellanos, February 2005. Mira was almost killed this afternoon, shot by a suspect we were pursuing. Thank God I was there. She's going to be okay. But seeing her bleeding like that, thinking I was going to lose her without telling her how I really feel was unbearable. Oh, he loves her. Oh. I think she feels the same way. That's lovely. There's something undeniable between us. It's against the code of conduct, but I have to let her know how I feel about her. I hope I'm not setting myself up for embarrassment. Oh, bless him. Lovely boxes. Ooh, lovely boxes. Thank you. Oh, Jimenez, you came in with me, okay. Just, uh, I'm just gonna, like, walk into the mirror. I'll see you in a minute, okay? D don't freak out. It's cool. There's a nurse on the other side. Doctor on this side, nurse on this side. Nothing could possibly go wrong. Don't you worry. <laughs> oh, shit. Spoke too soon. What the fuck, what the fuck? Oh, oh! 
Okay. She was there a second ago. I'm sure I saw an arm. I did forget to go get those statues. Never mind. I think I was just desperate to get out of that area at that point. Oh, she's over there. I don't think I have any more keys, and even if I did, I'm not sure I can really do anything right now. I think I might have to f follow. Maybe this is interference from the real world, you know, maybe I'm kind of somehow... Where did she go? The other door is do not enter, isn't it? She can't have gone in there. Yeah. Can't go through there, so it must be this way. But maybe I can hear voices of the people who are like... If, if I am, like, voluntarily in here for work, kind of thing. Like, my boss or whatever could be out there uh, saying something or other, you know, about how I'm a loose cannon or something. That's what they usually say about detectives, isn't it? Missing. Dr. Valerio Jimenez. Oh, he must be the brother, owner of the Elk River Hospice, last seen driving into the city. So maybe, yeah, that must be where I am then, Elk River. Like, um,. That weird village with all the bear traps and shit must be Elk River as well, I guess. Since that seems to be mentioned a lot, and also we're about to see the brother. Oh, I didn't think I could go in there. Oh, she's over there, okay. There's some fucking mad apparition skills you've got there, love. Is that a candle or something I can pick up? Or a mug of coffee that glows, obviously. <laughs> Silly me. Oh yeah, sorry, I said I did say I was going to try and uh no, not that way. No. Get through things faster. No, no, not that way. No. Who the fuck? No, no, not that way. No. No, no, not that way. There must be someone that's obviously not her saying that. Is there anyone in here? I didn't press X on this one. No. Okay. Well, I'm going this way. Sorry, pal. Hey! What's up? That sounds ominous. Are you Annie Wilkes? I don't think I want to go in here, but I'm going to anyway. Fine. The fine. fuck? Fine. 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 Oh, Leslie! Hi! Leslie's in my mind now? Oh, that doesn't sound good. Are you one of them now? He's gonna do the ah, thing. Hello, As in Roy. Do you no? take care of yourself? Oh okay. And we're back in the room. Missing patient found. Caretaker worried sick. Psychiatric patient missing since last Tuesday found hiding in photography studio. Physician Valerio Jimenez says God's will. Is that that must be Leslie then, yeah? Can I not go in here? Oh, I can. Okay. I'm gonna upgrade my brain. I did do that, didn't I? Yes. I do quite like the harpoon bolts. Like, they seem to be much better than the guns, but than the revolver, anyway. Uh, but then again, I do like a shotgun. No, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. See, if it's a shotgun, I'm not really, probably not going to aim for a headshot. You should go for the body. Uh... Multiplier. 
Oh, I'm just short of a damage multiplier there, so I think I might leave that then. Because uh, more damage is always good. And it seems like that's probably the weapon I'm going to have the most ammo on at any, any given time. Ooh, speaking of which, it wasn't that there was some more shells or, or bolts or something in here, I believe. And then at least, oh, I have both, excellent. Even if all I have is revolver ammo, at least it's a bit more... Uh, I'm trying to... <laughs> damageable was what I was going to say. That's not the word, I think. <laughs> it's too much beer for me. <laughs> Three sips is my limit. Uh, effective. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay. I know I'm saving a lot, but I'm paranoid. <laughs> I'm going to die a lot. I think we're good to go. Uh, there is no mirror in here. Going. Okay, let's go see your brother. Whoa. Whoa. You were not there a second ago. What the fuck? Okay. I mean, he does seem remarkably chill, considering I just, like... Either I went into a mirror, or I just stood there and ignored him for five minutes. <laughs> so where are we going? In here? Maybe? Oh, well, I need... No. I need some health, I think, don't I? Yeah, so I might as well use it. What could have happened here? And then take another one. I don't know, man. Well, he's talking. Which I assume means he's human. I'm gonna go upstairs first. Because that does not sound like a doctor that I want to meet. Yes, give me. Uh, nope. There we go. like skinning someone? That sounds like he's skinning someone. Ooh, matches. Excuse me, doctor, I'm just gonna loot your brother's house. I mean, you say don't fret, but I'm gonna fret if you're literally flaying someone downstairs. That's, that's pretty fucked up. I'm gonna put it out there and say that's a no-go. Excuse me, doctor, thank you. I'll hide here so I don't get in the way. Ow. <laughs> yeah, fine, you just leave him. If he's happy in there, then he can stay in there. Is he though? Doc, no, don't. Mm -mm, don't. It's me. Good doctor is here. This is my brother Valerio. Let's say original doctor. Peel away. I'm not a Yeah, he's totally flaying oh, someone. Oh. Please expose everything. Hey, what are you doing? I think he's just pulling everything out. Shit, shit, shit. Ah. What the fuck? Clipping through the wall. Uh, 
There we go. Let's see, can I, can I set him on fire? Yes, yes I can. I didn't think that was going to work because I couldn't set Chainsaw Guy on fire. Sorry! It was an accident, I didn't mean to set him on fire. Uh. Oh, he pulled his own face off. That's delightful. Oh, and he's alive. Oh, great. That's awesome. Hmm. Indeed. Oh, just in case you're wondering why I suddenly get achievements now and I know- oh, trophies, sorry, wrong game franchise. Uh, <laughs> trophies now and I never used to, it's because I had them switched off uh, so it didn't interrupt the video and then I thought, well, it doesn't really interrupt the video anyway, does it? Well, that's a spine and some keys. So that means I'm gonna have to yeah. Okay. Sorry, dude. Do I have to do something? What? No, that's not the button. Well, my... I'm pressing everything. I don't know what to do. There we go. Mm -mm -mm. I really want those keys. Oh. oh no <gasps> Sorry, dude. My bad. Oh, I only got one key. Do I have to go back in? No. Okay, I'm gonna put the lamp away now. <laughs> now that it's covered in flesh. I'm assuming that's the guy upstairs. I'm just gonna go. Leslie? Yes, it did. Let's go. But we're outside. Is this the same building? Yes, it is. Okay, I'm not going to build it right then. I really can't tell which way I came from now. I'm confused myself. Shit, I only have one bullet left as well. Although I have other guns. So it's not the end of the world. This way? Maybe? Can I open this one? No. Everything has a huge wooden fence in front of it. Well, keep up then, fuck's sake. Where are you? Ah, there we go. This is where I was looking. I must have gone in there, yeah. That wasn't even Leslie. Sorry. Oh, that was him. I thought that was another zombie. Thank you, even though I missed the first time. <laughs> oh, lovely. Uh huh. Ooh. Let's get some juice on the viscera. And I'll be on my way! 
Thank you. Cooperation. This way? Ooh. Yes. Oh. Oh, fuck off. Need to work on your cardio, bruh. Uh, well, I thought this was the way I was supposed to go, but apparently not. Well, you shush with the Claire de Lune music. At least the pigs are okay. That's kind of nice. In a weird sort of way. How did I do that? Fuck's sake. Why am I so bad at finding the right way on this game? Okay, I'm gonna assume it's up the hill. It must be up the hill. There's any more bullets kicking about? No, take a bottle. Ooh. We must find my patience, Leslie. I know. Yay, bullets! Just what I wanted, mommy. Juice. Is there anything or is that oh no there is something. Villagers note. They got Norman. His cries for help just cut off. I can hear screaming every night. If I don't stay hidden, I know I'll be next. Great. I mean, probably yes. Let's go. Okay, we can go now. I don't need any more matches. We can really go now. <laughs> Maybe I should go up there. Help! Help! Oh, what's wrong? There with we go. This kid? I'm assuming he hears some kind of voices, or there's something going on in his brain that shouldn't be going on. Poor little dude. gone down there. Great. <laughs> what are you doing, Seb? <laughs> Just jumped down the stairs. That wasn't even a jump, that was a weird, like, hop shuffle. We're going! You're the one who keep, kept saying, don't leave me! <gasps> Ooh, another one. That's in this one. Surely I have all the weapons now. Yeah. It's just ammo. Okay. Can't take that. Am I about to be in a really big fight? Cause I have no health. I mean, I have two needle things, but I kind of don't want to use them until I have to. But I feel like I'm being stocked up for something. Right, that's just gross walls covered in all kinds of shit. That's lovely. These photographs? That's... Well, I can see people, but... Just walk over the fucking books. Have you no respect, sir? Okay. Yes, gimme. So someone was... I don't know, maybe stalking someone? Oh, hey! How's it going there, bro? I don't think he wants you here, dude. Oh, no. The balls, are you invisible? That's grossly unfair. Oh, we're doing that again, are we? Something scary. Nope. Be still. Oh, there he is. Oh, okay, I'm dead. 
Oh, he's invisible. That is grossly unfair. Okay. Yeah, I was being set up for something. You could kind of see the outline. I think if I had realised that I didn't have any bullets in the chamber, that might have gone a little bit better. But you can, you can kind of see where he is. Sometimes the air kind of shifts a little bit and... I'll be right back. So I'm not entirely sure what the fuck happened there. Um, seems to be working now, but I've just realised I've already been recording for an hour, um, so I was kind of going to stop now-ish anyway. Um, so kind of a little bit of a cliffhanger to leave it on, I apologise, but it seems pointless to load it up for like one, one minute and then stop again. So I'm just going to leave it there, we'll cut our losses, at least we're moving on and we're heading in the right direction, and uh, we'll see where it goes next time, assuming I can kill the invisible dude. But I killed Chainsaw Dude first time this time, so in theory next time I should kill him straight away too. Right? That's how it works, I think. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Bye!